Hello ladies and gentlemen and welcome to a new episode of Fight Night by RFPW. Tonight we kick off with an extreme rules match set for one fall. And it all comes down to what happened last week in the tag team match. And Jimmy Havoc decided to take matter into his own hands and attack his tag team partner Will Ospreay. He's right over here. So anything goes, no disqualifications, no can-outs. Brad is wild here tonight. The aerial assassin is waiting. Oh boy, cue the red light. And the F you all by Jimmy Havoc. Oh, and he's looking more dangerous than ever. Right, never liked Jimmy Havoc. Unless he does, is just really required to wreak havoc. But other than that, mm -hmm. not really that much. Go, oh, Jesus. Go, oh, wow. Oh, amazing man of booze. What we could have expected. Just letting you take in what the crowd is doing. Let's go. And have it straight off with a neck breaker. And the amount of booze is insane. Now of course last week due to their DQ loss because they first have it mowed down the ref was in the ref the same ref as last week in his match. That cost them their first points for this uh, for the 2018 World Championship. Oh! Well, could have brought them because they would have gone on to vie this week for the Tag Team Championship, but that is not the case, and so they have to play it out right here. Oh, there they go over the top rope. Interesting choice there. And the canvas on the outside. Luckily, there's a bit of matting out there. But it's not the tickets, so it will still hurt more than inside the ring. But Havoc goes and takes Osprey now with a belly to belly suplex. And there he goes. This is what we know from Havoc. Oh, he takes out a table. But it falls down. Osprey intervened. He's going to try and take him out on the ropes now. Does let him fall. Osprey can be quite dangerous if needed. Oh, nice kick right into the face. Looking to go to the top rope as we know Osprey. A high flying gravity deploying action and he hits it with a elbow drop. It's an option, goes back to the top rope again. Inside five. 630 even. Holy crap. 
Turkan. That's close to finishing off right there. Tonight in the main event, myself, Jeffrey Blight and Dimundo will be facing uh, Mark Haskins. And someone else with a back team tires who don't know his partner yet. But maybe, who knows, maybe it's our time to claim a tag team gold. And then they've been a long time friend of mine. And finally after seven seasons I've been able to convince him to come over. One time from a commentator. Two time even. So good to have him on board this season. Have again to the corner. Osprey's going to take him up onto the ropes. Top right pair of Kamana. Altitude at which Osprey can get is tremendously impressive. Misses it. Uh, Fireman's carry. Fireman's carry slam. Table seems to have turned. Oh my god. What a hook and clothesline. Oh, two. Joel Buster on the counter. If you want to tweet out, use the hashtag Fight Night. Send those tweets to at RFPWE Fit on Twitter, Facebook. Or visit our website, RFPWE Fit. .weebly.com On our website we'll keep you updated on the match cards, the actual Wrestling Grand Prix point standings for those who will qualify into the Wrestling Grand Prix the Wrestling Grand Prix there will be 10 of them next year and the winners of those will receive World Championship points to crown themselves as the best wrestler of the year at the end of 2018 and the 2018 World Champion Kick up in January with the Western Grand Prix of the Netherlands. We also have new editions in the United States, Canada, Australia, New Zealand, I think Italy and Spain as well. So many great things to come. An expansion of the calendar. Havoc, meantime, wins the match. Bloody and well. The man is so impressive, he never gives up and it resents his enormous. It was a five. For, uh, 450 splash or 540 can't really rate that because it's going too quick for me to even visually encapsulate it amazing work by both gentlemen and even the high flying style of Osprey can't keep Havoc contained Osprey came close, that's all we can say at the moment. But it's not enough. I can say you tried. Osprey, look at him, and he's just like, yeah, I did it. Not too much more to add. Next up, we're going to take a look at the match between Lion Kid and Mark Andrews. They call themselves the Guardians of the Galaxy. What a bunch of a-holes. Uh, thank you very much, OSW TV and the Wrestling Matters podcast for the long-term partnerships. Mark Andrews has got a very quick action. Cruiserweight division. 
Back to full glory with the two-time former Cruiserweight Champion, Mark Andrews. New Town is lying, kid. Lion Kid has been burst around to the UK scene. Oh, Jesus. Oh, man. Oh, Jesus. Oh. Andrews is really taking a fight to Lion Kid. Made his debut last week. Oh! Well, I tried to get to his story, but Andrews is so fast. He doesn't even allow me to. Gets back in the ring, inside, out. Oh, man. Oh, jeez. I told Lion Kid uh, was on last week. He was originally scheduled to do so, but not. Um, but that didn't make the airwaves. But uh, Lion Kid's debut here tonight on Fight Night. Mark Andrews! Holy shit! Unbelievable. My God, take down. There it goes, Andrews again. Oh, oh damn. Two. Two. But there's amazing stuff. There he goes! Oh my god, how does he do it time and time again? Jeez. Oh. Lion King is getting mauled here. Jeez. Look at it! I thought Osprey did a great job, but this is even more amazing. Absolutely incredible. Oh! Powerbomb, man. Like too much. Lion Kid goes for the roll of it. And a nice kick to the back of the head. Better more side impact. Lion Kid on the top rope. It goes over. Gets the cover. Two. This is what we want to see, the cruiserweight action. Oh, no. And now on the apron. Why on the slides through, takes him out and goes for it. Cover. Took out, but could have been closer if the ref had not been that late. Jeez. Such a huge takedown. Now to the top pro, Andrews. Craziness ensues. Cover. And that's it, Mark Andrews is your winner. Bizarre high speed action. Unbelievable. Oh, 
incredible. Applause from the crowd here to all sides. Jesus. But it was all over it, it was flat flying. Wow. Oh, flank kept roll out to the outside. Ooh. But Andrews wins. Next up, we look at a triple trap match between the Priscilla Kelly, Lana Austin, and Mercedes Ritchie being the number one contendership for the Women's Championship next week. Who will take on Taylor Hendricks for the women's title? We'll find it out right now. Bell is wrong and we're on the way. Oh. Oh. Say he's Richie. Jesus. Former Academy Women's Champion. Oh, look at that. She's slowing her head into the cameras. Man. Lana Austin. There did farewell. Slowly getting back to her feet. Now it's Richard and Kelly going at it. Oh! What a backstabber. Take down to Lana Austin. She's not getting the best out of it. Oh, what a kick to the midsection! A oh, butt attack. women are going for it. Yo. These women make no surprise of it. Oh jeez. Stretching the arm. Submission holds. 
Oh, she's trying to kick, but she's continuously moving. Now Lana Austin. What a huge takedown. Oh, oh, cover. No, but she was in the ropes. Not allowed. When Patricia, uh, Patricia Kelly breaks it up. We go to the break. Uh, YTW18 Plus, thank you very much for being such a long time partner. Even though I really hate you at the moment. <laughs> but uh, besides that, great partnership. The Eclipse is better. <laughs> Covers possible. Richie is taking down Patricia Kelly. Alan Austin. Failed selection by Richie. Oh, break up. In a nick of time by Patricia Kelly. Richie again with the knee into the face. On the toe of the ropes. Oh my god, a superplex of the top rope. Cover. For the breakup. Dude. You want to have oh Jesus. That looks really painful. Oh, well, oh. What's Patricia Kelly doing? Oh, huge German suplex. I can't tell we got the most out of that. But maybe Lana Austin can capitalize. Oh, stunner. Gotta go for the cover, Lionel Austin. We'll advance to next week and take on Taylor Hendricks for the Women's Championship. And ladies and gentlemen, I have news for you, that will be the main event of next week. This was not an easy match to win. Triple threat is always difficult, but what an amazing result. Unbelievable stuff has occurred here. And so, ladies and gentlemen, your winner, Lana Austin. So next all we move to a match between Bad Bones, John Klinger and David Starr. Two guys making their debut here tonight. And we have received word that the tag team partner for Mark Haskin Snyder and the tag team title about will be Kenny Williams. That's going to be a tough one to beat. But I will be there with the Mundo trying to see whether we can win those titles. Oi, oi, oi. 
Bad Bone Jim Klinger, known for his work in Westside Extreme Wrestling. Curious to see what that will bring to the table. David Starr says, look at it. He calls himself the product. And the product just means he is what encapsulates wrestling today. But that's the key, I don't know. And whether he is the product, I don't know. Look, take a look at yourself and judge accordingly. Time to get the battle between John Klinger and David Starr. Oh. Tough start. That's all I can say. European up the coat. Well done by the American. Roll to the left leg. That is painful. We can hear the sounds. Oi, oi, oi. Two. And three. Ugh. It's not where you want to land. Five. Booze. Happening all around. Want to get back in time? Yes, he does. It's kind of curious whether he was actually able to, because it didn't really look like it. But then again, he did. So good job. And John Kling has got a tight lock right in the throat of David Starr. Now, huge suplex, bridging suplex. Oh, rolls over. Takes him in. Oh, and another takedown. Wow. J oh, no. Stay down. Well, push back with the elbows. And oh, on the knees. Oh. And he's on the apron now. Two. 
two. Well, you try. And again, the combination of the two amazing suplexes. Punch, Deus is awesome in the eight. From the turbo to the outside. Holy beep. This is incredible. Front runners of WXW. Now front runners. Here in our PW, who knows? Oh! Jesus, what a takedown! Damn! Uh, a one! God. Oh, John Klinger too, but not enough. Two. Ah, it's painful. Oh, huge, no, giant, swing, good night, John Klinger. Trey. Next up, we'll look at the tag team titles, but I'll be out and I'll give it over to my colleague. Hi everyone, it is Kevin Von Wiersch, and um, yeah, this is the tag team titles on the line. With Damundo and Jeffrey Blight against uh, Kenny Williams and Mark Haskins it's currently very first tag team champions of 2017 for season 8 the Mundo and Kenny Williams start off it seems like this should be a very very good match oh a huge throw across the ring straight from the start Wow, that was a very, very good hip toss. Double axe handle. And looks like a roundabout suplex, as they call it. Oh, that's not very, very good. But they can cope. Drop to hold into the elbow drop. Classic tag team action. Oh, and a nice German suplex. Tag me to Jeffrey Blight. It takes Haskins out on me. Now in a huge slide across the ring.
And now it takes him down with a power slam onto the canvas. Was he looking for an X? Oh, I don't know whether that will do very much damage. But he can try. Now elbow drop. And the fireman's carry. Good buster. He knows what to do. He's had a very, uh, very, very long history, Jeffrey Blight himself. He raised himself on the record, but we looked at some past databases, and I found he was a 13 time champion. Incredible history in the year. Uh, uh, especially in 2015 and 26, uh, well, early 2014 and 2015. That era, the very early era of RFPW, that is where he w was very, very successful. Aye. Don't want to take much damage across the head. Cool, as he's a tiny person. That'll be doing much more damage. It goes with a DDT. But Williams only able to get to a two. Smashes the arm. Now you gotta take a look at what he can do more. But destroy is important and get to the three count to win those tag team titles. As mentioned by Jeffrey himself last week, uh, well earlier I should say tonight, next week Lana Austin will challenge Taylor Hendricks for the Women's Championship in the main event. Also that will be a very very strong matchup and well deserved for the women here tonight. Including Patricia Kelly, Pai Van Neven, Mia Yim, Mercedes Ritchie, Michelle, Melina, so many women here in the new Season 8 roster. Can only be able to expand that, or so you will have to see what happens at Fight Night next week. Albus smashing! To the left shoulder. European uppercut. Go for the roll through and the neck breaker. Will he make the tag to the mundo? Yes, he does. Excuse me, I got the hiccups. Oh, misses the kick. That leaves a room for Kenny Williams. He's quite a big man. He's thrown out his hair. Completely adapted his personality as well. And that goes flat with his face. That will be very, very painful. Now goes again with the GDT. Looks like Haskins and Williams are on their way to win the RFPW Tag Team Championship. I wonder what that will be like. Oh! Not good. Oh, and now he goes into the rope again. Ooh. 
and Mark Haskins goes down very, very hard. Jesus. Two. to the shoulder blades people don't want Haskins to win this title because the audience in house doesn't want to if you want to then definitely make sure to comment and make sure to like the show as well as subscribe that will very help us uh, that will help us grow for a long while Tag made, Jeffrey Blight, gonna tick him down, push power by the Mundo. Maybe that will get to something, oh no. Ooh. Another take down, onto the arm, stretch. And will that be the top, the submission? That he does. Jeffrey taps out. The window couldn't do anything about it. So Haskins, Mark Haskins and Kenny Williams win the match. Thank you very much for watching Fight Night. Also on behalf of Jeffrey. Been a broadcast in the earlier parts. We will be back next week again with the Women's Championship main event. And who knows what will be in store for the Tag Team Champions next week or even for the RFPW Champion. Well, we may be even see the return of the Cruiserweight Championship after what Lion Kid uh, and Mark Andrews and Will Osprey showed us here tonight. Thank you very much for watching. The new winners of this match and the new Tag Team Champions, Mark Haskins and Kenny Williams. Congratulations. We'll be seeing you next week. Good evening.